In this example, it is saying that a figure shows a right angle prism ABC having refractive index 3 by 2 lowered into water. And here we are required to find the angle alpha so that the incident ray normal to the face AB will be reflected at the face BC completely. Now, if the light ray is incident on the face AB normally, it will incident on the face BC at an incidence angle alpha because if this angle is alpha, this will also be alpha. Here uh, we want that the light ray will reflect from the face BC. So, in this situation here, we can write for light ray to reflect at face BC completely here we can write the value of incidence angle alpha must be more than critical angle for the glass and water interface. So, in this situation the value of a critical angle for glass water interface we can write it will be sine inverse of mu of water upon mu of glass. If we substitute the values alpha must be more than sine inverse of mu of water we are given as 4 by 3 and that of glass we are given as 3 by 2. So, on simplifying the value of alpha we are getting it should be more than sine inverse of 8 by 9 that should be the answer to this problem. If the value of angle alpha is more than sin inverse 8 by 9, the light ray will completely reflect it on the surface BC and it will suffer TIR.